A quickening spirit gives life to a dying soul. As stated in 1 Corinthians 15 verse 45, and so it is written, the first man Adam was made a living soul, the last Adam was made a quickening spirit. The last Adam is Jesus Christ. And Jesus has made his servant, Prophet Aoa Makaji a quickening spirit, to give life to the sick and the dying soul. In this video, Prophet Aoa Makaji is seen lying on the terminally sick people as a quickening spirit to give lives to their dying mortal bodies. As the Bible says in Romans 8 verse 11, but if the Spirit of Him that raised up Jesus from the dead dwell in you, He that raised up Christ from the dead shall also quicken your mortal bodies by His Spirit that dwelleth in you. The Spirit of Jesus dwells in Prophet Aoa Makaji, the Son of Man. See how the dying mortal bodies of the sick, received life and instant healing when their bodies get in contact with the body of Prophet Aoa Makaji. This is the sign of the last and a major prophet of our time. Let's watch what happened to these sick brethren when Prophet Aoa Makaji slept on them. Who is the first son in your family? It's a woman. Please. It's a woman. You are seeing, you are seeing spirit of death in your dream. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Where have you gone to? For treatment. Central hospital, sir. What did the doctor say? He only asked me what is wrong with me. I told the doctor it's arthritis that I know that is wrong with me, but I don't know any other thing. You have not done scan any other thing. No, sir. You can't move where? No, sir. What of your back? Is this paining you? My back. Yes, sir. My back is paining me. Even my waist. Your waist? Yes, sir. Small, 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 small. Yeah? What? Don't run, small, small. Where's your family here? They're in Benin. They're in Benin? Yes, sir. How do you know this church? Somebody brought me. Check your back. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I feel better. What did the Amalis give you to drink? Water. Eh? Water. He gave you water to drink. Yes, sir. After taking the water, what did you experience? I experience anything. Hmm? Okay. The water is from where? Shrine. From the shrine. Is it chicken or because I'm seeing blood? Is it chicken they use or goat? Goat, goat. Goat. 
did they, where did they sacrifice the goat? Is it in the shrine or where? In the shrine. In the shrine. That's where they sacrifice. Okay. After you have sacrificed, how big is the goat? How much do you now put for the other thing they miss? All the total money they said I should pay was 35,000. Huh? All the small, small. Total money, all the whole money. Uh, 35,000. Okay. After all this sacrifice and the rest, did you get well? No. Hmm? No. But are you not a Christian? Are you not a Christian? Yes, sir. Why do you now go to Abalis? Can you just open your mind for me? Why, what, what led you to Abalis? Because I was tired. Hmm? I was tired. Sickness was too much. The sickness was too much? Yes. You don't go to church? I go to church. You go to church? So, after going to church, you pray. The sickness was still there. You now decided to go to Abalis. Yes, sir. Because Jesus cannot help you. Okay, this place will come now. Am I an Abalis? No, sir. Why do you now come to me now? I believe you will help me. Huh? I believe you will help me. You believe? You will help me. And I will help you. Yes, sir. Is a traditional problem. It's from your family. All of you. All of you are being, being battered by one sickness, one failure. Are you feeling cold? Not cold because I'm very lean. That's why I put on jackets. Because you are lean. You are very lean. How many years this one has been living like this? No, about six months now I've been sick. Are you fatter than this before? Yes. Fat? Yes, sir. Do you I know what they... I cannot eat. I don't eat anything. Do you know what they gave you? No, sir. Spiritual HIV. You don't have HIV, but they gave you spiritual... Can you eat? I cannot eat. Can you take Martina? I can take malt and meat. But you can take ordinary Martina? Yes. If you take ordinary Martina, what happens? If I take Martina, sometimes I feel pain. Even what if I drink water, I feel pain from my chest down to my stomach. If you take water, yes. you feel pain from, my chest down to from my here? Yes. Downward. Okay. Get me water. If you take water, so what you normally take now is just milk and mortina. You are managing. Even though you take water, you feel pains. Yes, sir. If they give you water again, you know what you know what to drink. I don't want to even take anything at all. You don't even take water. It's only me. It's only uh, mortina and milk. Uh, milk. And milk. Lie down. Drink it.
Why do you finish my water? Huh? Eh? There's nothing in your stomach. You finish your own water. If you run before, what normally happen to you? I don't have. To. I know if you run. No stress. Oh yeah, run. Let me see. Come again, run. Oh yeah, run. It's okay. What is happening to you now? I feel strength. You have strength. Yes, sir. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My brothers and sisters, if you are not coming to Thursday program, you are really missing. Yeah. Let's clap for Jesus for that. Because God is using Papa to touch us. I'm a living witness. God has used him to touch me. And I urge every one of us that are here today to make it a date next Thursday to be here and see the mighty work of God in this arena. I came here very sick. That was during the program, the breaking of courses. Papa touched me and said, I could go for deliverance. During that course, every time I the deliverance, the next Sunday, until that last faithful Thursday, he called, I was touching people, I came out, he looked at me. Then he started praying for me. He told me what is the problem. I said, I cannot drink water. When I drink water, I feel pains inside of me. He brought water. He said, I should drink this water. Immediately I drink that water, that, play, that pain disappeared. Let's clap for Jesus. Our brother, you said, before I pray for you, and brother, you said for the past six, seven months now or so, that if you if you take water, that you you'll be having problem pains all over your chest. You cannot even take water. You are only taking me and Martina. Yes, sir. But on that Thursday, you are able to take a whole bottle of water. Yes, sir. Then how was it possible that you are you that you are not taking water in the past? Only Mick and Martina. How will it be possible that you were able to take a whole bottle of last week, Thursday? It was, true, but it was the grace of God, sir. It was the grace of God? Yes, sir. Okay. Now, before you said you cannot run at all, that if you don't be falling down, you cannot even stand up at all. But nowadays, since that Thursday, are you running or you are still feeling what? You cannot run, you can if you stand up, you have a tiny eyes and all this. What are you feeling now? I have strength now. You have strength now. What is your advice? What is your advice to those who have because you said you have gone to so many churches, is that also? Yes, sir. You said yes, you have gone to Abalis. Yes, sir. And you have even given a goat to Abalis. Yes, sir. And then you have gone to hospital. Yes, sir. And then they did not see anything, but you are still sick. Yes, sir. What is your advice for those who are going through the same problem? What is your advice for them? My advice to them is they should look for a living church where they preach the word of God and where they do deliverance and act on to it. They should remain there. Let's clap for Jesus for that. What is your problem, madam? Let me start. How many years this one started? Yes. Eh? Six years, sir. Six years. Yes, sir. You cannot stand where? No. I'm seeing a little girl between eight and nine, ten, eleven. Ten, to a God. That's what I preach today. And the God they dedicate that ghetto is a God of the parent. And that get up. So please, let's. There is a native name they are calling you, but I'm seeing another name you are calling yourself Joy. Is that not so? But there's a native name they are calling you. 
That native name is connected to what it dedicated you to. Sir. Come, come. Because Jesus is Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ. Be free. Be free. Be healed. Jesus' name. Be healed. Jesus' mighty name. Be healed. The mighty name of Jesus Christ. Open your mouth. Open it again. Pack your load. Take your sickness from her. Out. Come out. Out of her. Out. Come out. Come out of her. Come out. It does no longer belong to you. Out. I break that covenant. I break it. I release this woman today. Be delivered. Thank you, Jesus. Be free. In Jesus' mighty name. Out of her. Out. Thank you, Jesus.
Thank God of Son of Man, these sick brethren have received their instant healing, and see how they celebrate the mercies and the goodness of the God of Prophet Aoamakaji. And if you have never believed in miracles before, watching this video should convince you that with God, all things are possible. But let it be known all over the earth, that there is a prophet in Benin, Nigeria, that God has chosen to heal the sick, and to do signs and wonders in these last days. Why not pay, a visit to Christ Supreme Ministry International today, or call. Plus 234, 803, 846. 3326 for more inquiries. Hi there, thank you for watching. If you love what you just watched, please do us a favor by subscribing right now to our YouTube channel by clicking on the subscribe button down below.